just like when we started, I told you I had cereal for dinner. I was standing there going, this is not a good choice, but yeah. I'm tired. I, you know, I justified it a million and one different ways in my mind. Yeah. And I still ate it. Yeah. 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 Because it comes down to that word that we like to share with our clients, consistency, mm. which means doing something more often than not. Mm -hmm. but it's the all or nothing mindset that kind of, you know, impedes consistency because people don't see, you know, well, geez, I ate all my other yeah. meals were, had more nutritional value, but all yeah. they see is that one drive through. And, and so it also relates to another um, cognitive distortion or a thought error known as disqualifying the positive. So we're <laughs> going to go back to the drive through with my client. And she was saying like, gosh, this is terrible. Like I ate this, like, it's going to negate, you know, everything. Absolutely not. You know what yeah. I mean? Just because you had one meal where you made a decision and you made a nutrient dense decision, all the other meals, and this was a calorie dense decision. You know what I mean? One meal is not going to ruin you because one meal isn't what got you to the place where you wanted to say, Hey, I need a change. Right. So, you know, I say, Hey, don't, don't beat yourself up and disqualify the positive. Mm -hmm. Understand that you made a lot of great choices before then. So you know that you can, 